after we champion in Jakarta, uh, we remember behind you there is there was Mr. Bolio Handoyo. <laughs> now uh, he is not a company with you anymore. Are you sure without Bolio Handoyo behind you, you can get away again? What's the last line? Yeah. Last line. Oh, last line. If there is, uh, I mean, if Bolio Handoyo is not anymore become your goods, yeah, are you sure that you can? Uh, uh, yeah, get a very good achievement on this tournament. <laughs> okay, yeah, so, so I've done extremely well under him last year, but again, I won my first Super Series without him. So I'm really confident that I can do even this year. It's, uh, like, it's definitely a very good coach. I, like, I can always tell that and I can tell that anywhere. But uh, to miss, like, not having him is like I'm missing something, but still again, it's, uh, <laughs> There are some things in life which you don't have them always with you. So I really want to, <coughs> you know, think only about the future and then play, that's it. Okay, thank you. Next, for the media, is there any question for the athletes here? Yeah, Ma Mavina, silakan. So you know, they begin on that. Mayuni, mungkin bisa ditim ke Chinese ya. Ah, iya untuk Liu Cheng sendiri dia punya hasil bagus di Piala Thomas kemarin dan beberapa kejuaraan terakhir juga performanya bagus. Untuk dia tadi kan main di Indonesia suatu keberuntungan. Seberapa yakin dia bisa tahun ini kembali untuk juara di sini? Oh, jadi nanti oke Liu Cheng itu sih. 呃，上个月的那个汤姆斯杯，还有就是几呃，有几个之前的比赛，就是你的表现特别好，然后就是呃，然后你也说就是因为这边可以说是呃比较大的幸运的一个地方嘛，然后就是你有多大的这个信心，就是能在能在这次的印尼公开赛拿到这个呃，可以继续就是卫冕这个冠军？呃，我觉得现在每一个对手都非常的困难嘛，所以说我们一定要全力的集中于每一场比赛，所以说。Uh, yang bisa dia sampaikan sih hanya dia tuh hanya bisa fokus uh, jadi step by step dari uh, uh, tiap match yang dia tuh lakukan itu itu yang bisa dia lakukan sekarang ini. Baik, terima kasih untuk jawabannya. Masih ada lagi rekan-rekan media yang ingin bertanya? Oke, okay, silakan. Uh, Pak Imam, paling depan. Okay. Uh, I will ask to uh, second Kidambi. In the first round, you meet Kento Mota, right? And we know that he has a very good achievement after coming back. Do you have any special preparation for that? Thank you. Okay. Uh, yeah, I think as you've already mentioned, I think he's been playing really well after his comeback. And I just played him uh, like two, three days back in a semi-final in Malaysia Open. So it was, a, it was not really a close match, but uh, maybe here on Wednesday, maybe I'll just try to play a little better than what I played in Malaysia, that's what I'm thinking about. There isn't any specific strategies that I've planned, but I really want to just, uh, you know, play much better than what I did there in Malaysia. Okay, thank you. Masih ada lagi yang ingin bertanya? Dipersilahkan. Ya, silahkan. Uh, my question is for... Miss Cinta Paul, uh, how do you see the what the women singles today? Because uh, Ai Su Ying just won her fifth in a row tournament. Uh, do you think it's uh, what there's a chance for anyone in the women single to beat him eh, to beat her? Thank you. Thank you. Uh, ada lagi 
Katakan media. Kalau tidak ada, saya akan mempersilakan ya. Yang di belakang, baiklah tolong. Saya dari Simpanim Agency. Pertanyaannya buat Dewi Chen. Dewi Chen, ni zai ben zi yi ni kong hai zai zuo le shen me yang de zi bei. Mbak, ini mengenai preparation yang dia lakukan untuk menjoin untuk Indonesia Open tahun ini. Jadi boleh dikatakan Indonesia Open ini merupakan turnamen yang sangat top. Jadi dia tu yang bisa dia lakukan tu yaitu tetap aja dia tu melakukan persiapan yang semaksimal mungkin untuk mencapai hasil yang memuaskan.